we're going to be talking about hand analysis, and we're working with a different modality or paradigm. I'm not a palm reader, so there's no tarot cards, no intuition, and I'm not going to dismiss that because that's valid in a different system. But this is true 10 out of 10 times. So I'm from the International Institute of Hand Analysis, and there we look at an empirical study of half a million people's hands related to their life pattern. And my mission is to use that and biohack it to reverse your age and live a happier life. So people come to a hand analysis normally because they've seen somebody else make a massive transformation. If you look at her, she looks pretty successful. Uh, her hand looks dry. I look at that and go, my God, that woman has some trauma. There is some uh, blueness around the lifeline. The hand is scaly. So she's successful and she's adapted to a life that's in her comfort zone. When we shift her uh, and we, we take that blood flow that is only in her fingertips, which is an emulation of your entire nervous system, which I'll explain. You just have to t accept that right now. And what we do is we then open her. Now, she looks a little younger. She's doing the same amount of yoga. She's ingesting the same vitamins. So I'm going to say something provocative. No amount of mushrooms that you throw at your system matters until you understand the architecture of the blueprint of your neurology. There's an appetite that's very specific for you. She needed a lot of oxytocin. So you guys know what oxytocin is. Raise your hand if you know what that is. Great, which is she needs a lot of kisses and hugs and love and stuff. Her hand changes when she gets that. Her body changes that. Her whole disposition, her youthfulness changes because she's now operating with a new experience that gives her the proper nutrition for the neurotransmitters and all the blood flows going all over the place. You look at this guy, he looks a little younger. Yeah, and this is five months later. That guy looks like he's, in the first photo, looks like he's been through a bad divorce and turned to alcohol. Here, he looks different, attractive, and he ends up getting, finally, the girlfriend after seven years. So we would call that part, in the beginning, the shadow side. You guys know what I'm talking about with the shadow side? What is the shadow side? Shadow side, you all have a shadow side. Your partner certainly knows your shadow side. And you may show it 80% to your partner, which means you're probably going to be breaking up soon or dealing with some type of separation. People come to me because they've been working with a massive amount of dissatisfaction in their life. She doesn't look so happy. And her parents are also mirroring that dissatisfaction. This is a 21-year-old who has been bullied and mobbed in Switzerland. And she has had uh, resorted to a lot of marijuana and a lot of YouTube to pass her life away. The parents have given up. She's rebelled. She's been in a room for approximately two years. She stopped going to school. And I get a hold of her, and I put her in a bad mood. I read her entire neuro neurological pattern, and all I do is piss her off. And then I break her through. And you're probably going, how do I do this magic voodoo? I show you how to hack your nervous system. You guys are all in your shadow. It's called Earth. And there's a percentage. It's called a parasympathetic and sympathetic system. And with the degree that you're triggered or having a low-level upset is the degree you're in your shadow. And some days are a little bit heavier than others. So what does this have to do with hands? I've been showing you a lot of faces. So... What we're looking at is a neurological blueprint that is uh, a deeply satisfying uh, work that I've been doing for the, since 2007. And it's equivalent to three years of psychotherapy. And I am not your, your therapist, all right? I uh, only show you a blueprint. And what we're seeing here is the same thing, and you can say the root of my work is not in palmistry. Because I know it's hard to believe. <laughs> 